You don't have to push the button then. Because it's not on video. That's not on video. Oh, <laughs> yeah, you can just use one. Good morning, Dr. Bloom. Well, good morning. How are you, Virginia, or, or Jimmy, or whatever they call you? Doing very well. No, you're, you're doing it all wrong. You need at least a pile that's... The pile of 4x4s four needs to be at least this, the height of your body, uh, plus another 20%. This is not nearly enough of the 4x4s. Four what are you doing? You're doing it all wrong. Virginia, you need more 4x4s. Four you're going to need another pile. All right, Virginia, you need to scrub a little bit harder, as though you're, as though you're actually scrubbing his facial skin off. Yeah, that's not even, not even hard enough. You gotta scrub a little bit harder. Yeah, there you go, there you go. You're actually tearing some skin. Hey, you need to be quiet, okay? She's, she's scrubbing you, you need to be quiet, okay? And I don't want you, don't be like, there's nothing funny here. Thank you, that was a good idea. Virginia, that was a good idea. Put a little bit more in his mouth. Yeah, that's a really good idea. I know I would have never even thought of that. Good idea. Yeah, yeah, good idea. Keep tearing the skin around his nasal bridge. Yeah, that ensures that that ensures that we've really got it clean. Because I don't want to go messing with his eye muscles if his skin's not really clean. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Keep doing mm -hmm. it. Yep, keep doing it. Anesthesia, can we give him a little more of said? I think he's in a little bit of pain. There you go. There you go. Do we have his arms strapped down? He's trying to reach up to his face with his arms. We have him tied down. What's that? He's in four point leathers. Okay. How's this, Dr. Bloom? You're doing a wonderful job. Wonderful job. Would you think about doing pediatrics? Ah, uh, yeah. Good. I'll write you a letter of recommendation. You're doing great. You've almost got through the pile. I, I think we need I think we need a little more four by fours. No, that's good. No, that, that means you're doing a good job. That's good. I heard something crack. There you go. No, that's fine. That's fine. We want them to be clean. The eye muscles are the most important things here. Not the nose. We're not worried about the nose. There you go. There you go. Right. Yep. Uh, I think about a four by fours. Guys, are bloom. I don't think I can scrub anymore. Why not? You're not done. I've done over a thousand four by fours. And why are you sitting down? When do we scrub sitting down? I'm sorry, Dr. Bloom. I'm just so exhausted. Well, you know what? I think he, lo you, you, I think he looks pretty good. Uh, Virginia, what happened to the other eye? I thought we were trying to treat strabismus. Well, obviously we can't treat strabismus with only one eye. I think we're going to have to well, cancel the case. I thought it was a permanent solution. You've, done, you've really done amazing there with the scrub, but I think we've got to cancel the case now. Good. Oh, Marcy. Yes, Dr. Barnstein. Yes, I'm talking to you. I need a scissor and I need a slit cut in my mask. Don't look at me like you don't want to do it or you don't know why I we're doing it. I didn't say anything. You don't even need to know why we're doing it. Don't worry about it. I need a, I need a three inch slit cut in the center of this mask. Just cooperate, Marcy. Don't argue with me, Marcy. Is Just that good enough? Just cut slit in the mask. You're making a mess of the mask. The other side now. Marcy, cut on the other side. You clearly see. Oh. The other side's not cut. But I already cut Marcy, here. Marcy, over here. You've used scissors before. Please, Dr. Barton's thing. Don't. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Hi, Dr. Bloom. Good morning. Good morning. How are you, Virginia? Uh, doing great. Why do you have a hole in your mask? 
Hurry right, up, Virginia Yankees, though, you've never done this before. We've done many cases, we've got a very busy OR day ahead. I've got plenty of interactive photos to take today, and I'm getting very hungry. I didn't get a chance to eat breakfast. I was in a hurry on my way out this morning. Don't blot so hard. Don't rub, just blot. You've done this before. Okay, but there's another, there's a big area right here that you missed. I'm sorry about that. I still have cookie remnants on me after I scrubbed. We can. Very good. Marcy, the cookies flashed. I'm getting hungry. I, didn't, I told you, I've already told you, I didn't get to eat breakfast this morning. Yes, they're ready, Dr. Barton. I called in early for my car. Good. Okay, but there's another, there's a big area right here that you missed. All right, Marcy, let me have the cookie now. This is the part of the prep where I need my cookie. Now, Marcy, you can see my hands are clearly sterile. Put it in my mouth. Marcy, put the cookie in my mouth. Marcy, put the cookie in my mouth. I'm trying. Looks very good. That looks very good, Virginia. You're doing a very good job. Mm, these cookies are very good. These cookies are great. Marcy, did you get a tan? Yeah, we like you did go on vacation lately. Where'd you go? Yeah. Marcy, can I have another cookie? Another one? I would like another one, yes. Don't question me. Marcy, stop fighting me. Give me the cookie. <laughs> did you get it? Put the cookie in my mouth. <laughs> Thank you. These cookies are a bit raw. Are they actually flash? And how long are they flash? They were and flash at what, and what, no, I'm still talking. At what temperature are they flash? I don't know. The prep job looks pretty good. I'm happy with the prep job. We can begin the case. Thanks, Dr. Barnes. We'll do that one more time.